Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I want to show you how to balance the chemical equation. But we need to use about vector in here. So now I want to show you how to answer. The first thing we need to identify the elements. So we have potassium in here that is about K. Later that we have M and the next one we have oxygen. The next one it, we have H and the, the last one we have hydrogen. So we need to put in this way. Next we need to set up the vector so in this one I will put about S number one S number two S number three and so on in here so for S number one So we have one cake that's it in here one m n we have four oxygen we don't have h and h so we put number zero and number zero in here so in this one we have one one four zero zero now we go to s number two In this one, we don't have cake, so we have number zero. This one, we have one. This one, we have four oxygen. This one, we have one ash. This one, we don't have hydrogen. The next one, the water. So for this one, we don't have cake, M and no, and we have one oxygen. We have zero H and we have number two hydrogen in here equals to S number four. So in this one, we do the same. We have zero K, one M and two oxygen, zero and zero. The next one, S of number five. In this one, we do the same. We have 2K, 0M, and 4 oxygen, 1H, and 0 hydrogen. And the last one. So this one, we have 2 hydrogens, 1H, 4 oxygen. After we do this way, we can set up the matrix equals to number 0. That means we put S number 4, S number 5, and S number 6 go to the left. So we have like this. So this one, if we put this one go to the left, we have the negative sign in here. And the next one, we have S of number 5 with the negative side in here. And this one with the negative side in here. And this one equals to number 0. Next, the negative will change the size of the numbers in here. So we put the negative go in here. And similar for this one. The negative of the number 0, they keep the same. 
now we can create this matrix in here so we write the same number one one four zero go in here then we have zero one four one zero the next one zero zero one zero two the next one we have zero negative number one negative number two zero zero the next one we have negative number two zero negative number four negative number one zero so the last one that is zero zero negative number four negative number one negative number two and this one that is about s number one number two number three number four number five and number six and this one equals to number zero in here so then later that we can use about reduce row echelon so I will use the calculator to do about this one and here is about the result in here so we have like this let's say s of number six I will put about t so that means for the first one we have s number one minus t equals to number zero so we put this one go in here so we have s1 equals to t now we can go to similar s number two we have 1.5 t s of number three we have t s of number four we have 2.5 t and s of number five that is about 0 0.5 t so in this case i will select about t equals to number two that means s of number six equals to number two so after we put number two go in here you will have s of number one equals to number two number three number two number five and number one so now we go back to this one so we put this number go in here and we have the final answer so number two go in here number three go in here number two go in here number five number one and number two and that is the technique how to answer this is the end thank you for watching